Just a few final details on this short video uh, before we talk about further configurations. When the machine's not in use, I mentioned earlier that you should locate it back in the cradle. And uh, this is the ideal place to locate it. And once you finish using the machine for the whole day, put it back in the cradle, pull the off switch, switches the machine off, and obviously put the machine on charge. Now, this particular machine that we're showing you today has got four suction pads. Each suction pad is rated at 75 kilos, and the working load of this machine is therefore the sum of those four pads, which is 300 kilos. Now, depending on the panels you're lifting, you will have a different arrangement of suction pads, even different capacities from 50 kilos up to 100 kilo capacity per pad. But we will send you the pads appropriate for the panels you're lifting. And they may be wide pads or narrow pads or even shaped pads for certain particular panels. Again, it's all about you telling us exactly what you're lifting in terms of panel type, thickness, surface finish and length and we'll send the appropriate configuration to site. So that's a quick um, overview of using the machine for, in this particular instance, 20, uh, panels up to 16 meters long. We're just now going to uh, give you a final video showing you different options for configurations. Um, we can't lift any bigger than this in our warehouse, but we'll talk those configurations through.